Where is everyone? Am I missing something? So, here we are. A video that I didn't think I was going to make. I didn't want to make. Um, but yeah, here we are. A very dark, dark day for everyone at our at this moment of time I am currently not a drama school student I'm not an hour student hour no longer exists they sent out an email this morning saying that they are ceasing all teaching to students due to financial problems and yeah, they're being liquidated and yeah, our no longer exists. It is no longer operating as an institute, which leaves a lot of students in a state of uncertainty, me included. What we know is that we have options. Rose Bruford have said that they are going to pick up any student at our that were willing to stay on with them. They're going to continue the, our training under their under the umbrella of Rose Bruford. Um, however, it will still be the same course that we already were doing with our they're not going to change they're not going to train us in their way but it will be Rose Bruford awarding us our, our qualifications at the end of our training rather than um, our and St Mary's which is the partner university that was partnered with our it's just a really, yeah, I woke, I woke up to the news this morning and I was, at first I was, I was kind of sad and I was kind of like a bit distraught, like, I kind of felt like I did when I didn't get in after foundation year, I kind of like going right back to square one again, but then I kind of thought about it and was like, no, I'm in a better place. I've wrote a screenplay. I've wrote a one-man play. I'm in such a better position than I was back then to deal with this situation. But then when I read more into the email and, and found the links and the whole Rose Bruford section, I realised that the situation, yeah, it's bad. We've lost this, you know, this whole central hub for the actors in the north but it's not as brutal as uh, as we fit like rose bruford are offering this lifeline for us to carry on our training as actors and it's not the end of the road it could be a blessing in disguise it could be something that catalysts a real change for actor training in the north but yeah it's a little bit downbeat at the moment like today has been just a really tough day for a lot of people but it's been refreshing to see the kind of coming together the whole industry has as shown on twitter on social media Everyone offering support to our students has been really, really nice and a real breath of fresh air to see because it's moments, moments like these that we need to stick together, you know, come together, support each other because if we don't support each other, then, you know, people will suffer and they'll really, you know, they, they, 
they will suffer on their own. Whereas if we stick together and we support each other, then only good can come out of that. So it's been really nice to see that. And yeah, we have a, a call with Rose Bruford tomorrow. Hopefully that clears up so many questions that we are left with right at the moment. But until then, we won't know. For now, all we know is we can either stick with Rose Bruford, who are going to teach in the building here up in the north of the mill, and um, I think they're arranging somewhere for the south students to to uh, train as well. Or we can explore our options and see if we want to try and maybe find a another institute that we might want to join and see if they will let us join their third year or their second year depending on what year because obviously it's not just us third years it's it's first years foundation the ma's both acting and directing we've all been affected by this and yeah it's a real it's a real shock it is but there is a positive and we got to hold on to those positives because if we can't hope for a better future, then what's the point of hoping at all? That's why we have dreams. That's why we fight for them. So, yeah. I've been Niall Anthony. That is my thoughts on what has happened today. I'll see you very soon for hopefully normal drama school vlogs i'll see you very soon <laughs>